Hi guys, Del here, welcome to the channel. Sorry I've not been posting much lately, but i um, been a busy old time with lockdown and business and everything else that's going on. Anyways, start cracking on with these videos. Today I wanted to, to um, review a Nightcore HC35 with you. 2700 lumen, and it's, it's um, part of the HC35 headlamp series. This is a great, um, a great flashlight actually. You know, there's many competitors out there, but this is this is particularly good and really robust. I'm going to show you some, just some a quick a quick overview on it, and then I'll be doing follow up um, follow up videos on it, and we'll we'll go through um, we'll go through how it works and how safe it is, and and the fact that it can you can drop it two meters into water and it'll be fine. You can drop it a meter to two meters and it's shockproof and things like that. But just just for now, we'll do a quick overview of it. And um, this one's from the Man Venture Shop, so they're on Amazon and they're on Instagram, and also I'll, I will put a link below in the in the comments title, and then that way you can click onto it and link it link it that way. But uh, follow me on Instagram as well, and you'll you'll see pictures um, of this and uh, a link to Man Venture too. So let's take a quick overview of this, and like I said. Um, keep watching and then in the future we'll do more follow-up videos on it. So here we have the HC35 by Nightcore, this is the headlamp series. 2700 lumen, next generation 21700 high performance headlamp. So let's get it out of the box and take a look at this. So everything's there I am on the inside, everything is what you get with it. Um, let's take a, a wee look and see what you get within the box itself. The torch itself, the HC35 unit. I really like this. It, feel, it feels really weighty in hand. Um, it's nice and big. It's not like some flashlights which are, which which are really small. I've got pretty sized, decent hands actually, and this is uh, pretty robust. It feels really robust as well. So let's take a little bit of a closer look at everything that we get within it. It is a lightweight and rigid CNC machine body. That's that itself, CNC machined. It's got the USB charging port at the back. You can see that. It's got the the four light series um, built into it, the Cree lighting. It use, utilizes a beach surface total reflective optic lens for uniform and soft light. So you can see that itself. It's not a clear lens. Um, it is a reflective lens. I like the feel of it already. What else do we get in there? We get the battery cradle. We get the headlamp accessories. To make it in the unit for your head to just that's actually really good quality I like the feel of the quality of that I like the sweat band the stretch of it you know sometimes you can buy these and they don't feel that good and you get these you can hear that too the solidness of that clip that's nice and safe that's not going to come out anywhere in a hurry of your head as you can see I like that that's extremely robust so that's the headband itself. This is the charging cable, the USB charging cable. Comes with a nice tidy on it. There's little features that make that you know they make them stand out above um, other flashlights out there, and such as the cable tidies. Something you don't always think about, but these things make a huge difference in keeping the, the cables tidy. So if you're carrying that in your EDC and you've got a cable on it, it keeps it nice and tidy uh, we cable tie like that little things like that make a big difference to me and um, this would be the lanyard and extra pocket clips now I'm not a huge fan of pocket clips tend to because they tend to break and then if they don't break they catch on things there's also within there there's a spare seal you can see that and then the clip now I've not put the clip on just yet the pocket clip because um, I'm just showing you the, the head torch band with it okay that's the lanyard it goes on. It's nice quality when you want to put these lanyards on. So they are they are good quality lanyards. Um, it's pretty good quality all over, really. To tell you the truth, I like the feel of it. Nice and solid, nice and robust. 
So we'll be doing some some future um, videos on this just to see how it how it operates um, in the different weather conditions and the pocket clip too. So let's take a look. This does have a five year product warranty on it. It comes with nice easy instructions and the guarantee. So we get all that within it. The Nightcore guarantee, worldwide five year warranty. So that's the warranty card there. So just the model number, date of purchase, serial number, and send that off um, and get that done. The Nightcore instructions, nice and simple. It tells you about the warranty service on it as well. The different languages, the features and the specifications within it. So we'll just take a quick look at this. It's a 4 Cree XP G3 S3 LED system for maximum output of 2700 lumens. Now that's an awful lot from a little hand unit like this. Averages out there for similar um, similar torches as this are normally around 1500 lumens. So it's bright. Um, it's lightweight and rigid CNC machine body for excellent cooling performance. So when it gets too too hot with it being on too long, um, it keeps it cool itself. I like the features. You can see on that, nice and clear. It's very robust. Absolutely solid. It's maximum peak beam intensifies. Uh, um, it's got an intensity of 4500 CD and a maximum throw of 134 meters. It's powered by a 21700 high capacity Lion battery. Um, um, we also charge it from the from the USB from the USB point. It is a rechargeable battery. There's also a power indicator and power voltage within the um, within the buttons once we once we get onto the functions of it. Its specifications. Its length is. 128.2mm oh, um, its head dimension is 28, 28 by 85mm its tube diameter is 26mm its, um, its tail diameter is 28 by 3mm um, and its weight is 138 grams so it's a pretty robust little package I like it a lot. It does give you other technical specs about the longevity of it, the, the use of it, um, the length of the battery, the battery within it and how to operate on the operating instructions of the on off um, different functions, allows the ultra low or the turbo settings and the special modes such as the strobe, the beacon and the SOS. I will show you um, those functions working later on when we get within that. So within it itself So there's the that's just a little check card inside to stop the torch from actually going on when it's in transit. That's the battery itself. You do get the extra cradle for when you you wanting to use the um, other batteries within it. Okay, so we'll place this in, and we shall put the base on nice and tightly. So that's its low setting. Whoa, that's its powerful setting and it's light just now. So that's its extra power power setting. It's it's a uh, beam setting. All good settings actually. I like that. So as you see, I was just cycling through the settings on that just now. A great little unit that. So that's a HC 35 by night car. Now that's me just unboxed it for you, and that was just a, a, a quick overview of it. And um, we will go into more detail of. It's operating, um, it's operating systems within the nighttime functions. So I will show you that. 
Um, so that, yeah, that was just a quick look at it. It's got a wide range flood optic system, 100 illumination angle, specially designed for outdoor applications. Um, it's incorporated advanced temperature regulator ATR module inside. It's um, specially designed, lightweight and breathable. Um, and the headband also. Um, electronic reverse polarity protection. Constructed from aero grade aluminium alloy. HA3 multi grade hard and is finished. Rating in accordance with IP68 2 meters submersible. So don't be an idiot and think you can swim in a lake with it. Um, for a long period of time, and it won't, it won't be, uh, um, it'll still be operating because it won't, it, you can't continuously submerge these. However, if you drop it or if you're doing a river crossing, it will be fine. So, that's basically just a quick look at the HC35 2700 Lumen 4x Cree. XP G3 S3 LEDS Next Generation 21700 High Performance Headlamp by Nightcore. We'll take a lot of a um, lot more detailed um, videos of this in the future, but I just wanted to show you a quick box opening um, of that particular model. Thanks for sticking with me. Um, I'll be putting out a lot more videos in the future now that I'm starting to get a bit of time back on my side. But that's your HC35 by um, Nightcore. Links for the Man Venture on Amazon and Instagram and the World Wide Web. I'll put on in my comments down there. So thanks for watching, everyone. Stay safe out there. Prepadel out. So we have HC35 Nightcore Ultra Low. Low, medium, high, and ultra high. That's back to low, ultra low, low, medium, high. An ultra high. It's a great spread and great light settings. I really like the different ones on that. Now also there is more. So once it's off we hold it off and then we can set that to a strobe function. It can be a bit fiddly to get to, to be honest. So when it's in the off position, you're supposed to be able to click it twice. There we go. So that's the strobe. That's really quite effective. Please don't watch if you're um, prone to blackouts and things with that. And then the SOS fun function. So that's SOS. That's actually the strobe setting. There's an SOS setting too. We'll get onto that. If you bear with me now, that's really effective. That. that so that's SOS standard save our souls. As you can see, my finger's not on that. It is actually alone. I'm not touching it. That's its setting. So I'm going to touch it now. Strobe, strobe again, and SOS. And then off, and back to its standard low, ultra low, low, medium, 
はいそういや I like that a lot as you can see it's very effective